people really are the game changer. And so I believe to be a good CEO, you have to be the chief customer officer and the chief people development officer. And it's that combination, that extraordinary commitment to people and your customers is really what makes the difference. At the beginning of the company, we were very small. We cannot hire like experienced uh, scientists. So most scientists that we hire really, like, don't have much experience. So I work with them, like uh, serve as a mentor for them, really give the, the training. But slowly they pick up their like, uh, skill, their capability. I think I've demonstrated leadership in almost everything I do in our industry. And I'll give you a few examples. Number one, within our trade association. I've served on the board for 12 years. I was president of the association. I created a lot of initiatives. Another thing I do is I work with kids. I think it's really important. Best piece of advice I can say is get out of the way of your own ego. Have humility. And don't be afraid to hire other people that are smarter than you. The best piece of advice I ever received was given to me by my dad when I started out in business. And it was under promise and over deliver and your customers will always be happy. And that is really what we do at the Philly Pops. We over deliver. When you come to a show, you come out saying, wow, this was worth the money. We can't wait to come back. Over the years, I've gotten a lot of advice. And I think staying true to the mission is really about how to thrive in a market that is so complicated like this energy sector. So it was a professor, Kenya Mariyama, from back at the University of Pennsylvania in graduate school and it was really about focus and finding a way to look inside challenges, understand those challenges, and then tackle them with tenacity and also some agility to move and bob and weave as the market changes. The secret to running an efficient manufacturing process is to manage design engineering changes. If you can effectively control that, not only are you providing a proven product that's already been manufactured, but your assembly people, your wiring people, your quality control people are also familiar with it. We quality check everything, incoming, in process, and outgoing. When we find mistakes, we do a root cause analysis and implement preventative and corrective actions to prevent the problem from occurring again. At the end of the day, I know Narula Restaurant Group has been successful when we have converted a few new people who would have never otherwise tried Indian food to actually come into our restaurants, enjoy the food, and become regular customers of not just ours, but Indian food in general. One of the things that we really, uh, I think, do well is we have good pipelines for talent in our company. One example is we use three co-op programs here in the city of Philadelphia. We partner with Mercy Vocational High School, Edison High School. We're proud of keeping that pipeline full, and we think it's an important part of our growth for the future.